Hello and welcome to PLZ Soccer's Wednesday Evening Bulletin, brought to you by Indigo Communications. Rangers manager Steven Gerrard has urged striker Alfred Morales to score more goals, with the Colombian one short of 100 for the Ibrox club ahead of tomorrow's Europa League match with Bronby. Morales has scored just five times this season. He missed several chances in the weekend's draw with Hearts, but he'll hope he can help Gerrard's side get a lifeline in the group stage against the Danish opposition. And Conor Goldson will also feature for the Jers tomorrow. The 28-year-old claimed today he's no nearer to signing a new deal which does expire in the summer. Under fire Aberdeen head coach Stephen Glass has said that chairman Dave Cormack's impassioned defence of the management team was a good thing because it showed his passion for the club. The Dons are really struggling at the moment. They're down in ninth place. They're on a winless run of 10 games. I think the, the good thing for supporters of our club is they saw how passionate the chairman is about the, the, the situation at the club. Uh, the, the belief that he's got in the people that he's got in here, including the, the group of players, which is important too. Newcastle United have parted ways with manager Steve Bruce by mutual consent, with the six-year-old set to receive an £8 million payout. The hunt for the next Magpies boss will begin, whilst Bruce said the job had taken a toll on his whole family and it may be his last in football. And Celtic winner Jota was the star of the show in yesterday's 2-0 win over Ferenc Varos he provided both assists. His first was a perfect through ball for Kyogo and the Portuguese winger opened up about their connection. Well unfortunately Kyogo doesn't speak um, doesn't speak English so it's been quite difficult so uh, actually it's funny because I said to Kyogo, Kyogo if you don't uh, if you don't um, learn English no, no worries because I will try to, to learn some Japanese for us to talk. Thanks for watching and don't forget you can catch up on today's football show. It was on exclusively on PLZ Soccer's YouTube channel. The panel back discussing yesterday's game for Celtic and also building up to tomorrow's match for Rangers.